Go. Oh. Go. 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 <laughs> Wait, are you doing it? <laughs> <laughs> hey there, YNAB kids. My name is Hannah, and I am your friend here at You Need a Budget. Now, earlier this week, our friends Ben and Kelly had a very important question to ask us. What is money? Now, a lot of you may have watched their episode already, so by this point, you probably know exactly what money is. But shh, don't spill the answer. I have some friends about your age that I wanted to ask, hey, what is money? And here's what they had to say. What is money? Shiny coins. Um, money is you something that you buy stuff with. If when you buy with coins, dollars, and cards that you pay stuff with. For example, if you want a treehouse, you need to have enough money to buy it. I study with money. You don't know. We all have to learn about money at some point. And sometimes even moms and dads have to stop and really ask themselves, what is money? Ben and Kelly shared with us earlier this week that money didn't always exist. We used to trade and barter instead of using money. If I'm doing arts and crafts with my friends and I run out of all my green paint, I might find another friend who still has some green paint and say, hey, would you be willing to trade your green paint with me? I can give you some twine or this tape or my extra glue stick. But then what if the person I want to trade with doesn't need twine or tape or an extra glue stick? They might not want to make the trade. Well, friends, that's where money comes in. Instead of trading a bunch of random items all the time and hoping our friends want to make the trade with us, we decided to invent one thing that everybody wants. Everybody wants money because you can trade money for anything. I can trade money for some green paint at the store, or I can trade money for this delicious chocolate treat. And now, all these years later, everybody has money. But hey, that makes me think of another question. What do we use money for? Mm, it's really easy. Buy toys. We use money to buy important things like houses, food, and water. We use it to buy things to keep, to make so we have shelter, so that we can keep safe. Our needs and sometimes our wants. We use money for buying houses, buying cars, like stuff you need and stuff you want, like Robux, V-Bucks. You use money to either buy things, pay for things, like a mortgage or like your house or like... Yes, Grayson, uh, those are... insurance? Yes, those are so good. And Thanks food for food and water and electricity and gas and pretty much it. Thanks for sharing. Oh, and toys if your kids want them, like birthdays and stuff. They're exactly right. We can use money to buy, well, anything. I can buy small things like a toy or big things like a whole house. So then it makes me wonder, where does this money even come from anyway? Money comes from the bank. The White House. It came from the government. Where I get money is from, it's from my grandma. Some money comes from like the stores and the places you go. A bank? No, a money factory, I guess? Money tree? <laughs> it comes from the council. City council, I think. No, it comes from the government. What? <laughs> hmm, looks like we have a lot of different ideas about where money comes from. But don't worry, because in the next few weeks, we're gonna learn where money comes from. So make sure to keep tuning back in every week with Ben and Kelly and me and my YNAB kids friends. But in the spirit of trading, I have a game for you guys. It's called Trade Up. What you do is start with something really small with little value, like this hair tie. Now, find someone in your house who's willing to trade something bigger with more value for this hair tie. So I might go to my mom who needs to put her hair in a ponytail a lot and see if she'll give me a granola bar. And now that I have this granola bar, I might go see if my hungry brother is willing to trade something of bigger value for this granola bar. 
Keep trading up and trading up and see how valuable of an item you have by the end of today. Well, I hope you guys learned a lot today and are excited to come back next Tuesday to join Ben and Kelly in learning more about money. <laughs> Why is it so hard to do a YouTube video? Can we please have scripts? <laughs>